Oh, can you believe me with the dog? Shanice with the dog. I just can't even believe it. Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Shanice. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, definitely make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. And if you are not new, what's popping? What's good? Welcome back to the channel. So, as you can see by the title of this video, I'm going to be... <laughs> Sorry, it's my little puppy. As you can see by the title of this video, I have a new puppy. I never ever thought I would ever get a puppy, own a puppy love on a puppy or a dog i just never thought it was in the cards for me because i just was never a dog person um but my fiance my man is and yeah we ended up getting one so i'm gonna just be showing you guys 48 hours with a new puppy this video was inspired by sophiology i think that's how you say her name she did a video like this i thought it was very interesting because i am new to dogs and i was just like let me see how this is really gonna be and yeah, it really actually wasn't that bad. So here we go. 48 hours with a puppy. Oh, and by... Woo! Hey, don't lick my face. And by the way, she is a Merle Yorkie. As you can see, she's so cute. And she is, I think, nine weeks now. Say hello, everybody. Hello. Hello. She's so cute. She's like a little teddy bear. <laughs> Anyways, let's roll these clips. Okay, we got a new addition to the family. Yes. Yes. So we are going home with a puppy. If you guys are you know, looking for any Yorkies, Merle Yorkies, definitely. Yorkies of Austin. Yes, we will leave the link down below as well as your Instagram. You guys can check them out. You should be having a new litter. In um, February. 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 Yes. And one in May, right? Yes, yes. yes. And we have still some available right now. Yeah. Hello, Yorkies of Austin. So Woo, say hi to the new family. Yes, this was a major headway. It yes. was. Yes, <laughs> a lot of growth. I must be so happy right now. Yes, um, <laughs> can't wait to love you. <laughs> yeah. He's already loved. Yeah, yeah. thank okay. you so much. Yes, thank you so much. You, you definitely made this like process a lot easier. Yeah, yeah. such a looker. And she's gonna be the next top model. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. See the way you move this dirty Diana. You say don't get comfortable. We are on our way to Petco to pick up some Got stuff some for the dogs. Should hopefully it's not that big. Just reminded me. Probably in my in the car. Okay guys, we literally went into Petco for like two seconds. We just needed a bed. Um, we needed, we got like two toys, and then we also got, what else did we get? <laughs> um, oh yeah, we got a collar, so I think that's all we really got, because um, our breeder actually like gave us like a kit to go home with, so we got her food, um, we got some pee pee pads, and we got a blanket and all that so we want to get like cuter things off of amazon just because there's more variety so we are probably going to wait um for amazon um to get everything else that we need we definitely need to get like a playpen um somewhere where she could sleep and stuff and play around in so yeah y'all can you believe me with the dog shanice with the dog I just can't even believe it and I'm definitely warming up to her a lot. She's so cute and so small. This is what happens when your Caribbean mother like tells you don't get a dog. Okay guys, so she just got home. Brian's room and our second bathroom is probably going to be the spot where she stays at. There, she's coming to what's familiar. 
We gotta think of a name for her. So if you farted. guys have it, no. Brian just farted. Um, but if you guys have any suggestions for names for her, let me know. Uh, Chloe. Chloe's kind of cute. She look like a Chloe, guys. We'll get the pee pee pads out. Even though I feel like it should be on the hardwood floor, not the carpet. I'm gonna let her roam around a little bit and get familiar. Ooh. And as I was just talking about pee pee, she just pee peed on the floor. Where'd she go? We're trying to see if she would follow us to the room. Oh, she's right here. Yeah, luckily our cleaner just came today too, so made, she made sure everything was clean before the puppy came and it was so crazy because we didn't even know we were going to get the puppy today at all. It was literally, I'm just like, fine, like, let's just do it. So, um, yeah, it's going to be an exciting night. I see the way you move this dirty Diana. You say don't get comfortable, I'm too hot to handle. Many promises but no guarantees Just say to believe all that I can be I see the way you move rhythm talks and you listen Coconut spelling no way you get down to business yeah. Said I'm drawn to you and just can't get enough Question mark a mystery even one thing for more Caught me at first sight I know that I can be the one to change your life Hey mommy, it's time for you to go get some food So come on Okay mama, you got your bathroom Mama with your food And yeah, water What's over here? Is it cold? We got some food. Mm. You hungry? Mm. So this is actually the food that the breeder gave us. So she gave us some of her food. Um, do you know what kind of it was called again? Uh, no. Nah. I got it on my Amazon stuff. You not hungry? Hey, guys, Mama. I'm going to eat a little bit. I want you to eat. Hey, there, she go. there she goes. Scrumptious. <laughs> I was a little worried about the dog food, but it's a little petite. Little small little pebbles. Eat away, puppy. I guess she just wants she just wanted to get a little familiar, I guess, with her surrounding before she took a little bite of her food. Is that right? But she's definitely gonna need the uh a little in here because this floor is so cold. She's gonna yeah. need that little if I gave it too much food. Probably. Yeah. But I guess I'm she'll stop. Soon. Yeah, she'll stop when she's hungry. Mm -hmm. I mean, when she's full. So how do you feel to be a dog owner? I'm so happy. He really wanted this dog, like, so bad. I wanted a dog so bad, we made the perfect compromise as far as breeds is concerned. I don't care what people say. A dog is a dog. I don't need no pit bull, no Rottweiler, a Doberman. We ain't got no big backyard yet. Yet. <laughs> ain't no yet. She's watching. You don't fall in love with a dog. Then I want no water to wash it down with, right? Did you just call her baby? <laughs> First you call your mom babe, now you call the dog, the babe. dog babe. 
That's how you know all my sweet talk goes to you. And anytime I say something sweet, I just throw a babe on. <laughs> you have any? Oh, there we go. Spoiling her already. <laughs> She's thirsty. She is freezing. Look at her shaking right now. The floor, the floor is kind of cold, to be honest. Like she was literally shaking before. Like now she doesn't even shake anymore. Like when we were first holding her. Mm -hmm. She's getting used to us already. Y'all, they trained April so good. She already peed on the pad. We do have the pad also in the bathroom, but um, we just have it, another one here just in case. You did so good. You did so good, mamas. You peed over there. Great job. So proud of you. No peeping on the carpet, right? Good job, mamas. Such a good girl, such a good girl. We're so proud of you. She did pee once on the carpet, but um, she also peed on the mat over here. So it's really good. I guess she kind of just had to mark her spot. I don't know. Yeah. Night number one. Look at our baby, sleeping so peacefully. Mm -hmm. Not a bad first night so far. It's only 8 p.m., yeah. 9 p.m. I <laughs> wish we would get on camera how she used, used the pad earlier. Yeah. Like a good girl, and I praise her. Wait, she just needs to get her eyes open. Yeah, she opens them. She sleeps with her eyes open that day. <laughs> Sucking her tongue just like she needs to. And she's sleeping. So we left the doggy in the room. And she's barking. Oh. I have to bring her in the room. I'm coming back to see if she's okay. Small little baby screaming. It's bedtime now. We're gonna see if this little area works for her. It's okay, mommy. We got the light here, you know, so she doesn't feel like she's alone, but she's sad. She does not like this. Oh, Brian really wants to bring her into the room. No, unless I should bring your Google home in here and give her some music. You can try that. Let's try it. Yeah. How about you? Oh, Mama's was crying a little bit. She's sad. She doesn't like being by herself. We have this little nightlight right here. Brian's going to try to bring the Google home and we'll see. Because we just really want to separate like our room from like her space. So we're going to see. Don't be scared, okay? Don't be scared. Everything's okay. Brian is currently setting up the Google Home. We're gonna try to play some music for her, like jazz, something soft. Hopefully this like relaxes her. Ooh. Hopefully this relaxes her. She could feel like something or somebody's there. And she'll be okay, but we'll see. Hey guys, so I gave in. And I had to bring the puppy in the bedroom and she can sleep here until we get a crate for her. So I made a makeshift crate right there and she's calm. 
So I couldn't stand hearing her howl and scream at the top of her lungs. I feel like it's eventually gonna happen though. <laughs> yeah, and we're gonna have to break her in soon, but when we get a crate, I don't think she likes the mat on tile versus the mat on carpet. She reacts to it differently on carpet. Good night. Good time with baby. You went pee pee again. Good job, baby. Good job, baby. Good job. You went pee pee. She went pee pee when I went. She's been really good with these puppy pads. You've had a good night and a good morning, huh? Huh? Huh, mama? So she was crying last night. I had to put her in a room. She's so cute. I'm still trying to find what's the perfect amount for her to eat. She's been eating a little bit more today than she did yesterday. I wonder how long I should use these pads before I replace them. puppy well first day and night with the puppy it went pretty pretty well so y'all seen earlier that we tried to leave her in the second bathroom just so she can have her own space and just so she could get used to like not just being clingy and onto us but obviously it was like her first night here and I guess maybe she was scared we don't know maybe she was sad from leaving her family and her little puppy friends so brian just could not take it anymore after he heard her crying so we brought her into our room and just like um put some things in the way so she couldn't get through it and she literally like slept like a baby but every time i moved she did like get up and just you know but, like she would literally just go right back to sleep so she was a good girl right brian mm -hmm. Love yeah she's a very good girl she's so chill like i'm just like i want her to like walk around the house and everything and just, I don't know, waiting for her personality to come out. But I also love the chillness. Like, this is kind of what I was asking for, if I'm being quite honest. So, yeah, we are on day two. This morning, Brian woke up with probably at the crack of dawn. It was probably still dark outside when you woke up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, Brian woke up and she peed on the pad, um, took a poop on the pad, and then started playing with Brian. It seems like in the morning she has a lot of energy. So that was nice and it was really cute. Um, so we'll see what the rest of the day has in store. I just cannot believe I have a puppy. It's like, I just never thought me, Shanice, I would have a puppy ever. It's all because of Brian. Good morning, mamas. Good morning. I think we're gonna name her Stormy. Stormy? <laughs> you like Stormy? I don't know. We'll see. We love you. We love you. 
I love you. And she loves her little toys too. She be biting them, playing with them. See? Ooh, don't bite my head. And she loves her blanket, this blanket. I want to get her a cuter blanket, but she really loves this one right now. I want to get her like a more fluffy blanket. She loves her bed as well. We literally just got this from Petco. But her temperament is like literally really, really chill. Hey y'all, so what I noticed about her is that she's extremely anxious. And of course it could be because she's in a new environment or whatnot. But as soon as you leave her, she starts shaking um, and just gets really sad. As you can see, like her body is shaking right now. And what I did read up on Yorkies is that they are just extremely anxious dogs. So that's one thing definitely to keep in mind. Hopefully once we get the crate, we can like crate train her and you know do all that good stuff but i just literally went in the shower i came out and she was shaking and just looking for me wherever i was and um when i was creaming myself or lotioning myself i put her in my room right here um just so she could see me and i left to put on my you know my little fit i went to my room to put on my fit and I guess because I left her for like a period of time, I just kind of wanted to see what she would do. She ended up peeing right here. So I think when she's like nervous or anxious, she pees. Because I did literally right before that, I put her on the pad multiple times. I showed her the pad and she didn't pee. But as soon as I put her over there, she started shaking and then she peed. So I don't know what we're going to do about that. <laughs> she's just extremely nervous. Like if I leave her for like, you know not even a minute she just starts getting anxiety as soon as i'm back she's good like look at her she's all good she's all good aren't you aren't you mamas you're such a sweetie okay guys so it is dinner time she does not like this tile floor i think it's way too cold for her um, so she's literally like shaking right now. I don't think she likes tile at all. See, I think her paws or something is cold. Are you finished eating? No more food? All right, y'all, so it is the last night, and again, she is sleeping in our room because we don't have a crate yet, and she will just be crying all night. So we just decided to keep her here, but as soon as we get the crate, we're gonna start crate training her. So yeah, I'm literally about to go brush my teeth, and I'm gonna hold her for a little bit while, um, well, before I go to bed. She's so sweet. Does she? Okay, go pee. Come here. You got it. You got it. Okay. Good night, baby. Good night. I love you. I love you so much. Y'all, it is a few days later and... My girl has so much personality now. I think she's getting just more comfortable in our house. And she is just bouncing off the walls and has a lot of energy. Look at her. She, she's stopping for the camera. She was bouncing all over the place. And I think she's teething now. So she's literally biting everything. She's like biting on here. She's biting on that black thing. Biting on my toes. So... We do have a few toys in there for her that she can bite on, but she literally prefers to bite on everything else. Ow. Don't bite hard, okay? Don't bite me. Don't bite me hard. It doesn't hurt, but I don't want her to get into biting anything. 
That's why she can bite on this toy. That's about it. <laughs> Definitely teething. And also Brian's room is like her little comfort zone. Once she leaves this room, she's a little bit more nervous and shaky. So yeah, even though that bathroom is finna be her room once that um, her crate comes, we're still waiting on it from Amazon. Hopefully it comes soon so Brian can go ahead and start crate chaining her. But honestly, she's so sweet. You just love to bite. Y'all, this is me and baby girl like every single day. She just loves sleeping right beside me, taking her little nap. She's so adorable though. She also sticks out her tongue just like me. She's not doing it right now, but usually she does. Y'all, the cuteness. Oh my gosh. So cute. Whiskey, store here in town. As a distillery, it's important to be close to your water source. And Jack struck liquid gold in the mid 1800s when he moved his distillery to Lynchburg's Cave Springs. And Edward Brown, Jack Daniels, was late in the spring water back here. Yeah. You like your belly rub? <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> you like your belly rub, baby? Yeah. Yeah, get your good night belly rub before you get in that bed, yeah. Walking downtown and I'm okay He's got it all figured out That's what they all say, yeah Everyone's looking at me thinking that I'm different Everyone's looking at me thinking that I'm living But I don't really care what they all say It's easier said than done That guy Walking downtown and I'm okay Eyes on me, I don't know what to do So I smile and I wave right. Everyone's looking like they know what they're doing Everyone's looking like they know what I'm pursuing I'm trying not to give them the time of day It's easier said than done That guy Yeah.